you record a Microsoft Teams meeting, that recording is stored in the Microsoft Stream video service. After the video is processed, it will be posted in the meeting chat so the attendees can watch back the recording. I find that sometimes a few days or even a few weeks later, someone will ask me to share a meeting recording with a new person so they can be brought up to speed on something. I used to find that I had to go to the meeting chat, then I had to find the recording or look in stream uh, for the video in order to share it with them. Since I do a ton of chatting in Teams and I make a lot of video recordings, that kind of was tedious and I had to go hunt the thing down. Fortunately, Microsoft has brought out a new meetings tab to the stream website so I can get to a list of just my team's meeting recordings and share things a little bit faster. Let's take a look at where you can go to find your meetings all in one place. To find the new meetings area, I just go to stream.microsoft.com or you navigate to stream using the Office portal. Once you're logged in, you'll see this new My Content tab. If I click on that, I'll see Meetings right here in the middle. Click on Meetings and here you will find a list of the meeting recordings where you were the one that pressed the record button. The list of meetings is automatically sorted by the upload date, but you can also sort and filter it by a bunch of other attributes. From this screen, you can share the video or even download it and share it with someone outside of the company. Speaking of which, let me show you a real quick way that I share meeting recordings externally when I need to. We've already found the meeting in question, so let's click the little dot dot dots or the ellipses and let's click download. Once that recording is downloaded, I can move it over to my OneDrive and right click and hit share. So I drag it over to my OneDrive right here and then I can right click on that file and I can hit share. If I choose the anyone with this link option, then anyone that I send this to will be able to watch that recording. Or if I want to control that file more, I can click the specific people option at the top and I can enter the email addresses of those that I want to have access. And that's how I share meeting recordings externally while we wait for external stream viewing. Anyway, I hope you have a great day and thanks for watching.